Hi everyone, in this complete guide to Pictory AI, I'll walk you through the easy and efficient way to make AI generated videos perfect for YouTube and other platforms. You'll learn how to transform a simple script into an engaging video in just a few clicks. If you want to follow along with this tutorial, click the link down below to sign up for a free trial. There will be a discount code for you, but more on that later. Once you've set up your new Pictory AI account, you'll see several options, script to video, article to video, edit videos using text and visuals to video. I'm going to kick things off with the script to video feature as it's not only fascinating, but also the most commonly used function. To start, just click the proceed button right here and you'll be taken to this page. This is the script editor and it's crucial. Remember, a common error is not pasting your script correctly. You can use a script from ChatGPT, write it yourself or have a freelancer do it. It doesn't really matter. Just paste your script directly into the video editor. Here, for example, I have a script ready to go for today's video. I'll just copy it and then paste it right here from my clipboard. This script was actually crafted using a ChatGPT strategy, which is super handy and produces really engaging content. I'll go into more detail on how this works later in the video, but right now it's important to note that leaving the script as is won't generate the best video. The automatic captions and headlines added by the software will be overwhelming. You should format your script to be broken down sentence by sentence. By structuring it this way and entering it into the software, you'll see a significant improvement in your video's quality. What I'm going to do now is add a few spaces to separate the sentences. It already looks better, but I can make it even better, which I'll show you in a bit. Now that we've inserted the script, it's being read by the software. The software automatically adds videos based on the text in the script. And this process is complete. So our whole video is now done because Pictory AI has software that directly puts videos based on what you put as the text. In my video, the first sentence is, do you know that the highest number of pyramids is in Sudan and not Egypt? As you can see, the video that was automatically selected behind that sentence shows the pyramids in Sudan, which is perfect. If you move to the next scene, which you can do here, you'll see the red light district and they have chosen to show the red lights. So what you can see here may not be 100% accurate right away. So if it's not what you aim for, then you can change all of the scenes or at least the ones you don't like. Here's how you can do it. You have the storyline, which is essentially the entire script, and then you have the visuals. By clicking on the visuals, you can select any scene that you want. Now the great part is that Pictory AI is integrated with Storyblocks. Storyblocks usually cost $30 per month, and here you can find pretty much anything. For example, mountain hiking. Click search and find the results right here where you can see different types of clips. So it's pretty great that Storyblocks is integrated with Pictory AI. So let's make an example. For this, let's make a video about the red light district in Amsterdam. I'll type red light Amsterdam into the search, hit search, and it will bring up videos related to our search. I'll click on one of these because I've already marked this scene in our storyboard. Adding this clip as the background will accurately complement the video. Then return to the script and apply this method to each line. For example, I have a line about a football club that's been dominating the Dutch league for years, but the text layout isn't quite right. I'll adjust the font size to 26 for better readability and limit the captions to two lines. Remember, you have full control here. You can change the font size, make it bold, adjust the color, background, and even the placement. You get the idea. You can alter virtually everything. If you decide to update one aspect, you can apply those changes to all scenes at once by clicking apply to all, which I highly recommend over making manual adjustments scene by scene. Now, if there's a clip I don't like, like this one here, I can go back to the visuals and search for clips that fit better. And remember, it's crucial to format the script sentence by sentence to avoid complications. For example, this sentence right there is a little bit too long. If you click on it, you can also see that right here. I definitely need to change the size of the text, but then I have to make it very, very small in order for it to fit, which doesn't look too great. Now onto the next part, which is searching for the right clips. When you're going to search for clips about a specific topic, like a place or an event, it's best not to overly match the video with every single sentence as it can detract from the main topic and might not align well with your script, making the content less specific and impactful. I'll show you an example of how you can achieve a great looking video. Video. So I'll ask ChatGPT to write a YouTube video about Amsterdam. I'll request an intro with a hook 
To keep the viewer engaged, I asked ChatGPT to include the Canals, the Red Light District, and the Ajax Football Club. By breaking down the script into individual topics, ChatGPT was able to generate a great script that covered everything I requested. Now that we're almost done with our video, I'm going to change these scenes for each clip to match, and then add background music and a voiceover. If you want to see me do this, keep watching. If not, feel free to skip ahead. So next I'm going to go to visuals. What I'll do now is search for Bike Amsterdam. Storyblock usually is able to find it, so if I scroll down right now, you can see that these are people biking in Amsterdam. I think this clip, compared to the other one, is much better. Now that you're all set for finding the right clips for different scenes on your video, it's time for choosing a voiceover. So if you decide to choose Pictory for your voiceovers, you can find a selection of different types of voices, male or female, and there are a variety of options which you can play with. Now that we're done, let me show you what we made so far. Did you know that Amsterdam has more canals than Venice? A red light district that's both fascinating and controversial. And a football club. That's been dominating the Dutch league for decades? We're about to reveal all the secrets of this captivating city. Please, know that the generated draft may not be 100% perfect since it's the first one, but you can always make adjustments to it yourself by adding pauses, changing the speed, pitch, and pronunciation. Once again, click the link down below to sign up for a free trial on Pictory AI. There is also an insane discount code waiting for you if you click the link. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section below and I'll be happy to help. Have a fantastic day ahead.